All right. So I had a moment to check out what it is that I was supposed to, I guess, get. And I'm sort of missing like how I was supposed to know it. Um, it's a little frustrating, actually. So that's okay. Welcome to episode three of Let's Play 3D.Game Heroes. And we're picking up where we left off. Did I say three? I meant to say 13. And if I said 13, I still meant to say 13. Okay. So what is it? Is it turns out that despite the fact that my map is marked to come here, uh, in fact, the sage is in the inn. So you know what? I am going to go ahead and I'm going to use one of my wings because that that's just agitating. Um, hopefully, you know, hopefully there's some kind of fast travel item eventually in the game that'll let me kind of do this without having to consume it all the time. And I mean, it's fine if there isn't. You know, um, using these like homeward bones, basically. All right, so he's apparently inside the inn. How was I supposed to know that? I don't even know. Maybe, maybe the music was supposed to be like a hint. So hey, oh, the secret haunt. Nope, 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 nope. Is this him here? All right, and they all look so much the same, right? I hate to say that, but they really do. <sighs> Are you the one who brought back the desert's treasure? Yes, yes, master. Akadu found the orb. Ah, that is indeed the orange orb. Then you beat the stone golem? <laughs> yeah, eventually. Naturally, Master Akato is a hero who can repel any monster. Ho ho ho, you have quite a sidekick hero. Fairies aren't usually so trusting, so you must be ex truly extraordinary. I've been waiting for someone like you. You mean you're the sage? Ho ho ho, that's right, I am Octane. Hi Octane. And you have done well, Master Akadu. I shall grant you the power of the orange orb, hero. Hey, hey, it's another one of those uh, coins. What does this do? Got a shader magic normal map. That spell can create shockwaves to strike ground foes. Master Akadu, I don't get it. It's called normal map. Well, yeah, these are all like graphics uh, terminology references, like pixel shader and, uh, uh, you know, a normal map. Normal maps are cool. They're like bump maps. And what are bump maps? Uh, bump maps were basically like these grayscale images that you could uh, apply uh, alongside of a texture over like, you know, some geometry, um, like, you know, meshes or whatever. And when those bump maps were applied, they would actually affect the way that light would interact with it. So it could create a false sense of depth. Um, and that's how you actually basically added like fake geometry over real geometry to make objects look truly 3D. Now, if you look at a uh, bump map from the right angle, it's gonna it's gonna kind of show because it's still kind of flat or it's literally flat. Um, and so they came up with um, they came up with normal maps. Now, I want to say that uh, traditional traditional uh, bump maps uh, only could go values zero through 255, right? So what is that? That is uh, two to the um, Let's see here. 10, 24. Uh, what, what? One, one, two, four, eight. That's, and then 16, 32, 64, 128, and then 128 to 256. So, anyway, it's, it's what? That's two to the ninth power? Um, which I, you know, that doesn't make sense to me now that I think about it. I must have skipped a number, but that's okay. Um, but those were the values of which you could actually uh, have bump maps. So they weren't as diverse. So they went ahead and they did something where you could do basically what is like 65,300 and uh, whatever, right? I, I don't, you know, I always forget that number. Um, but I think that's then two to the 16th power. But you could actually have the full RGB range uh, to represent depth. And so normal maps then would actually make it like look even more kind of scaled. Still kind of flat, but it's a better technique. And then of course you have uh, like spectral, uh, and I don't I don't think they're called spectral maps. But anyway, getting back to this. All right. Uh, but it makes shockwaves. Can't these spells be consistent? Huh. Say, Octane, we'll head for the next temple. Have you been to Lake Garland? There lies the Aqua Temple. It's south of the castle. Le South? Thank you. You know what to do, Master Arkadu. I do. I begrudgingly head to the Water Temple. Because I have a feeling like the Water Temple is going to be supremely frustrating too. And really, uh... Alright, so what is this? In fact, yep. 
right? That's probably a normal map. You see that it's flat and it just displaces the uh, it just displaces the light. It creates a little wave. Now I don't know what it does though. Um, so that's really interesting. Maybe we'll find out. Um, and we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna consume our last wing. And hopefully I don't live to regret this, because I think I will. I'm gonna be like, oh man, I really wanted to go somewhere. And all right, so that's that's where that is. Well, you know what? All right, so let's go there because I think we wanted to get um, some dancer, right, from Colnaria? Or was that Rayjack? Well, luckily, they're neighbors. So, let's see here. I wish there was an easy... No, it was the uh, martial artist chick. I think she was from Cor Corneria. Ha, <laughs> Corneria. I like Star Fox, right? No. Colnaria. Monsters are scary. Can't go outside. I'll let you play. Yep. Nope. Come back later. All right, so we get to play maybe a video game at some point. Need a room? Nope. Please come again. Welcome to my store. Take your time. What does he have? Oh, yes! Elixir. Restores everything. Honestly, I don't need the elixir. Sleeping bags, magical bags, candles, lamps, wonder dust. Uh, yeah, wonder dust. Oh, oh, I can buy the wind wings. There's like a value pack. Uh, all right, so 220. That's a good deal, right? Five wind wings, yes. Because you know what? That'll enable us to get around faster. Yes, I absolutely want to shop more. And then I want to get... The wonder dust is kind of cool, I guess. But I'd rather have something that I can count on, which is going to be opening up my menu and getting this... All right, very cool. Nope, don't need to continue shopping. So finally, we actually have something that'll allow us to come back when we die. Or no, no, I'm a liar. We have something, though, that'll actually allow us to heal in a dungeon, which has been like a huge problem. So let's go in here. Now this town's pretty small. We can go through all of Culinaria pretty quickly. All right, how's it going? Our town is running out of food at this rate. Mommy, I'm hungry. Oh man, you know, maybe I can bring them some food or do something, right? Be the hero. Um, you know, and at some point too, I need to go ahead and upgrade my new cool sword. I mean, it's super cool on its own. Yeah, okay, a spa. I mean, how am I gonna bring her a whole spa? I don't even understand. Okay. All right, so there's just that one area, I guess, left in this town, and then we'll go north to, uh, like, Dotnia. Oh, wait, no, we're all in Dotnia. Wait, uh, how do I? Oh, yeah. No, I'm just thinking about this wrong, wait, what? Oh, okay, no, no, no. I want to go this way. Talk to him. Oh, don't kill him. Uh-huh. Okay. I mean, not inanity, but, uh, you know, I don't need to... I don't need to know that. That's not helping me. It's not doing it. Oh, hey, maybe you are. Maybe you guys can take out the monsters in the Aqua Temple, eh? Yes, maybe we can. Okay, so we talked to her about the Aqua Temple, and I actually thought she might have been, like, the trigger that made it, like, the right place to go at that point in time, but it wasn't. It was not the thing that we needed. Okay, that's all right. We're going to go to Ray Jack. And really, you know, every village trip, regardless of like how much it feels like I'm kind of derailing what I'm supposed to be doing, is actually pretty beneficial. Oh, yeah, I forget about the rabbits. And, you know, maybe we'll come across some poles or something that, you know, we didn't... Uh, we didn't use or, or something like that. Blah, blah, blah. There's, of course, that beginning area. I kind of like it, though. Um, it does capture the, the feeling of exploration that the old Zelda games have. Or had. No, have. Yeah, have present. I really wish, you know, I, so I'm actually avoiding doing any Nintendo property because it turns out that Nintendo... As, as a publisher, or no, as a developer, uh, maybe as both, really. They don't like people doing Let's Plays, so that's unfortunate. <sighs> yeah, they, I mean, I consider it uh, a derivative work. I think that's sort of the proper way to look at it. I feel like this is, you know, the commentary is very much a part of the experience, and so it's a pretty heavy modification. Another letter, yes! Gee, that guy is too persistent, it's creepy. Please, just keep the dingy thing. 
But I do have a favor to ask. I've got someone in is interested in, I'm interested in. Can you deliver a letter to him? I'm counting on you. All right, where's the guy? Got a blue letter. He's a friend of Deke, the inventor. He should be here in Rayjack Village. Cool. So, like, a fetch quest, but not, like, a terrible fetch quest, I hope. Or maybe it just continues to turn into, like, more of a fetch quest. Red, apple, green, apple, blue, stick a candle, candle, lamp. I don't need any of these. Blue potion's kind of cool, I guess, but, uh... And I'm, like, what? I'm, like, three, three rupees... Wait, rupees. Or, uh, three Gs away. Right? You know? Oh... I don't know how many. I just just wanna... Okay, so... I make... Ah, you make bats. I know that. I know you'll make me a nice bat. I don't need a nice bat. I do need to know what the bestiary does, though. A real spa egg. Okay, so there's someone else talking about spas. Wanna see some magic? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Meow, yes. It's Percival. Yes, okay. Um... That's right. So let's see. What does this do? A rare book of monsterology. Okay. But. I don't remember where Deke the Inventor is. Satori note. Swords. Yep, yep, yep. Maximum potential. You know, maybe, maybe it's worth it to, no. Beam. The sword beam? Yeah, let's see. What does that do? That would be cool. I've never extended my sword beam before. Oh, that's right. I don't, ah, I'm just three away. Each Nissan, right? Huh. <sighs> Okay, let's go. We checked out those places. Or no, we didn't check out this place. Is it like a weapon store then? Do they, does this game actually have vendors that sell weapons? Maybe. No, 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 no. Nope, no swords, just arrows. All right. Interested in playing Dash Circuit? Yeah, sure. Good luck! Okay. All right, I don't know what Dash Circuit is, but we're about to find out. Mmm! I just like that annoying race and, um... All right. View the tutorial? No. We're just gonna do it. Hit shot! Go! This is a good way to get practice with the dash. All right, maybe I can get better. Hopefully. Presumably, presumably I can get better. All right, let's try and do this tight. Ah, okay. Uh... So is this just like infinite? Can I just keep doing this? Goal! Okay. Best, no record. Congratulations, a new record. Try again, yes. I think we can do this. I think we can get comfortable with how this works. I actually hope there's like a prize or something. That would be really cool. 43 seconds, so I didn't even spend a minute doing this. Oh, look at that. We're already off to a better start. Ah, Kind of. I'm trying to do it flawlessly, but man, it's really, it's really tough, actually. I know, I know, I, right? Like, oh, geez, Carl, why are you just doing all this? Final lap. I bet you there's some kind of a trophy for doing it perfectly. I mean, you know, like, it's perfect as, like, not hitting the walls. Goal! All right. Yep, I beat my time. New record. Try again. I bet you there's, like, 30 seconds, right? 30 seconds seems like it's probably the magical number for this. 
And I think I can come close. All right, come on. Focus, 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 focus. Ah! Focus, focus. Focus, focus, focus. Focus, 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 focus. Ah! Focus, focus, focus. Focus, 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 focus. Ah! Ah! Focus! Fo fo ha ha focus. All right, was that like 32 seconds maybe? What was the time? 30.29. A new record, I understand. I think I can do 30 seconds. I'm almost positive. So let's do this one more time. Focus, focus, focus. Focus, 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 focus. Ah, no. Focus, 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 focus. No, focus, focus. Focus, 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 it's 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 the it's those trees that are making it really just ridiculously difficult. At that one side. 31. No. No. I do want to try again. I think I can do 30 seconds. All right. Get set. Focus. Turn, 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 turn. turn. No, get in the game. Turn, 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 turn. Turn. Turn, turn.